We're at the Louvre. I missed my flight this morning. How pretty Amsterdam is. I am starting my day off at Starbucks in France and I don't know why it's not focusing. So I moved places, so now I am at this cafe. It's like this internet cafe and it's actually really cute. It's called Anti Cafe and it's five euros for every hour and you get unlimited drinks and snacks. So I think that's awesome and the Wi-Fi is going so fast. I was at Starbucks for 30 minutes and it only it only uploaded six percent i've been here for two minutes and it's already at 76 or 77 78 it's going to 79 <laughs> it's going up by the second so this place is awesome if you're ever in paris please come here and support this local business and i wish things would pop up like this more in the u.s where like it's only like ten dollars let's say ten dollars for an hour and you get unlimited coffee snacks and wi-fi i feel like that's just like a really cute concept and like the place itself is super super nice it's a really gloomy day in paris but this is my oh my god i only have three minutes it's already at 94 95 it's it's about to be done this is insane i've never actually seen this fast of wi-fi this is great the runners we're at the louvre They're pretending like they're running at the loo. Walking to the Mona Lisa. Excuse me. There she is. What do you think? It's cool. <laughs> this should be the famous painting, not that little tiny thing. You guys, Darby and I are at this cafe and we got quiche and brie cheese with bread and she got a martini and I got some rosé and quiche green beans like salad. This looks amazing. So excited. <laughs> you guys, look at this chocolate. It all looks so good. It's a little boutique in Paris called Michael Clouseau. Clouseau? I don't know and we are here for the macaroons so look at how good they look and I have yet to get macaroons in Paris so this will be my first time and I'm really excited guys hi hey <laughs> I made it to Amsterdam <laughs> missed my flight this morning um but I'm here now I got a train and I'm here and it's very pretty and now we're about to explore and yeah that's what we're doing how pretty amsterdam is this is just like the fault in our stars <laughs> have you seen that movie so pretty we are in like a central part of amsterdam what is this called like a square or a quarter whoa pretty I'm at Starbucks and this I thought was really cool. So they like show you everything in the smoothie before and then they blend it. Whoa. I thought that was really cool and interesting because we don't have that in the US. But yeah, this one's very similar to France. So nothing that different. I am at this really cute restaurant. It's kind of like a food truck place but in Amsterdam. And it's like a food truck place, but like not food trucks. But it has a bunch of little shops. Like it's like a little market. It has a bunch of little shops from like every other country, or just a lot of different food. Lots of bars. It's super, super trendy. It really feels like I'm actually back at home. Um, we're obsessed with it. It is so, so cute, and it's so crowded. It's only I think Tuesday, and it's like so, so crowded. But yeah, Amsterdam 
far is really nice. I definitely did have my expectations a little too high though for being a pretty small city, but other than that, it's really, really nice and I'm so excited that I came and actually got to witness it myself. I would love to know what you guys think if you've ever been here. But yeah, I think I had higher expectations because I think I'm coming from Paris, which I think is a million times better.